today I will teach you chapter 4 of complete. The name of your chapter 4 is Formating a Document. So student, first what comes in your mind? What is formatting? Student, formatting means making changes in your document. For formatting means making changes in your document. Just like you are applying font, you are applying font color, you are applying italic, underline, bold. What you are you going to make changes that all are called formatting. That all are called formatting. You are giving space, you are giving space in between two paragraphs. Means in each line there is a different space. In each paragraph there is a different space. So, all these are some in formatting. So, in this chapter, we will discuss different formatting options of Amazon. So, our first heading of this chapter is changing the font tag. Changing the font tag. So, students, changing the font type means what is font? When we are using Typing, when you are going to type anything, that set of characters that is called font. When you are going to type anything, just like it is written changing, it is also called font applying, it is also called font. So, all these are set of characters that is called font. But, students, font type, what we are going to change? Font type. So, students, I am going to give you one example of your class only. Students, in your class, there are so many students. But, each student having the different handwriting. Each student having the different handwriting. Your handwriting, particular of one student's handwriting is called font. That is called font. So, in computer, there are, there are also different type of habits different types of font. So, in MS Word, how can we change? In MS Word, how can we change the font? See. Just like what we will do for make the changes font, we will go to the home tab. Where we will go? We will go to the home Tab. Afterwards, we choose font group. Afterwards, we will choose font group. There are different types of fonts. Then we choose font which we want. Afterwards, we choose the font which we want. Means, there are different types of fonts. Means, English, Hindi, Whatever we want in Hindi, there are different types of font. Just like in your class, Hindi, written by everyone. But, everyone having the different handwriting. So, in Hindi also there are the different handwriting in computer too. But, in English, there is also the different handwriting. Just like font, there are the different fonts. In computer also, you can make changes. Okay. When you are going to make your document, students, you can see the different font type and you can make change. Okay. Next heading of our fourth chapter is applying bold, italic and underline. Applying bold, italic and underline. Means bold, italic, underline. There are the three options but the main option of Amazon. Bold. You see first. It is simple way, but it is the different way. This is the simple text and this is the bold text. This is the difference between the simple text and the bold text. This is called the bold option. Means when you want to make your text any text for indicating the difference from other text, then you can use both. If you are typing the heading, you 
can make bold. So whenever you are going to type anything, you can make changes. Afterwards, italic. This is your simple I, and this is your italic I. Means this is your simple I, and this is your italic. Like this way, you can make some changes. Afterwards, last one is underline. This is the simple U. This is student simple U. But when you are using the under, so line will make like this. Underline, it is made like this. So students, this is for font type and bold italic underline bold italic underline students means bold if you are to make your text from different text tick from the separate from other text you can make bold afterwards underline if you are to make underline you are typing heading you are indicating something in the paragraph you are note you are going to write any note you are typing application in that time you can use underline in many places. Italic, just like bold, if you want to make separate from one text, two text, from different text. So you can use italic that time. And font type, you can use home, font group and font. But you can also go to the font whole page. When font whole page is there, you can see font font color, font size, everything is same. But in, in short way, I told you home tab and the font group and choose font. Which font you want, you can choose. Which, in home tab also students, one option is also there. One option is also there. This is your font. Afterwards, font size afterwards color okay here from here means from here you can choose different font different types of handwriting from here you can choose size size student means if you want to make the bigger size of your font so you can choose a different size afterwards color if you want to choose color for your heading red color for your writing blue color you can choose according to you. okay so this is all about today now afterwards our different headings we will discuss in our next video thank you for today